everybody welcome back to my channel in today's video i am going to be talking about my current top five favorite skincare products that i'm using in my routine why i like them what's good about them and just a little bit of information it's going to be a very quick and simple video probably won't be very long because i just wanted to film something a little bit quicker today so hopefully you enjoy it i really love skincare and i also have my own little skincare business i know i mention this in like every single video but there is a reason for this it's because i make my products this is how i make money so this is why i mention it but this is like the most perfect video to mention it in because it's a skincare video but if you like skincare products like me or you're interested in any of the products that i do then i have my ebay and etsy always listed in the description of my videos and also my social media for it so instagram and facebook if you just want to see what i'm posting about and things that i get up to then check that out as well um but obviously it's completely up to you so the first product product number one by the way i've only got five products because i wanted to keep this quite simple and quite stripped back i didn't want to you know waffle on the first product is this so this is the creighton's pink grapefruit daily face scrub i think you can pick this up in Lidl. well this is where i picked it up so yes you can and this is basically a daily face scrub i have mentioned this in a beauty haul that i recently filmed like a week ago or so but basically this says that it unclogs pores and makes your skin look clear and radiant and the reason why i really like this specifically is because a value for money this product is amazing it's literally like 80 something p and you get like a full size product i think that's personally great the smell of it is really nice it's great oh that was a terrible idea <laughs> i just leaked loads of stuff I opened it, oh my god, that just smelled good though. I opened it to smell it and then um, loads of, did you just see that? Loads of water just came out and leaked on my leg. Um, but it does smell great. So yeah, I love the smell of it. Grapefruit scented. If you don't like grapefruit, obviously you won't like it. But I really like this. And I just like how it is a nice facial wash. It makes your skin feel really clean and fresh. Like it really does give that fresh feeling. But also it has those little scrubby bits in it and there's not too many. So it's not like a proper scrub where your face will feel like i don't know you've used sandpaper on it it's like little tiny pieces so it will just make your skin feel nicely kind of slightly exfoliated every day and it just makes your skin feel that extra cleaner than like a normal facial wash and i just love this and yeah i knew that it wasn't going to be like a really strong powerful scrub because it says daily on it and no one would recommend to scrub your face daily so I knew that it would be quite gentle. And yeah, I love this. So if you like clean feeling skin, this will be perfect for you as well. And also if you're on a budget, again, this will be perfect. Also, side note, if my hair looks weird, it's because I literally just put it up into like one of these little croissant things um, because just to kind of get it out of the way, you know, but I can't really see in the camera too good. Product number two is this from The Ordinary. So this is The Ordinary AHA 30% and BHA 2% peeling solution basically this went like viral on tiktok a while ago i had actually tried this years ago anyway and i didn't really understand it back then but i do now it's really great for exfoliating the skin and i've seen a lot of things about people saying that you shouldn't really use um really kind of harsh scrubs on your skin because you can have like little micro tears in your like skin cells and stuff like that so it's best to go for like an acid or a peeling solution or something like this so that's why i picked this up and yeah my skin feels so soft after i've used it i think if you have sensitive skin this might aggravate a little bit i'm not sure but i think it will because sometimes if for example i had the tiniest bit of dry skin it just aggravates it a little bit um but overall my skin is oily and not sensitive so it overall is great i love this it makes my skin feel clean and soft and i it's not that feeling that you get after you've scrubbed your face because it's kind of like a feeling of almost you face feels a little bit numb when you've scrubbed it like do you know what i mean or maybe it's just me i don't know um but yeah it, you don't have that feeling but you just know that it's working and also i notice after using this for a few weeks that my skin is a little bit clearer than it used to be and it's because i've been consistently using this along with my other products as well but yeah i would recommend getting this it's very decent price like i think this was like six pounds something from the ordinary i could be wrong but it's around that kind of like price tag I hope <laughs> um but yeah i would recommend it because a little goes a long way it's like a little 
dropper bottle and quite a thick kind of red consistency and you kind of rub it into your skin leave it on for 10 minutes and then wash it off so it's kind of like a little face mask kind of treatment thingy um but yeah i use this twice a week i don't know how often you meant to use it but i use it twice a week and it's, it's been fine for me so i don't know if you meant to use it like less but who knows next up i have one of my own products now in this video because i knew i was only going to include five products i didn't want to just list all of my products. I wanted to pick my current favorite one. Now I do have a favorite that is not this one that I'm about to show you, but I can't show you it yet because it's a new launch that's coming soon in a few weeks or whenever, I don't know, um, but it is gonna come soon, um, ish. So I can't show you that, but my current favorite, which it does change, my current favorite does change amongst my products, um, as time goes on but at the minute it's my cleansing balm i have recently repackaged a lot of my products and for me i just like how perfectly the label fits on the packaging that's not why i like the product by the way but that's just an added extra but yeah i just like how perfectly the label fits um because i had to measure it obviously to make sure that the new packaging i bought would fit the label which it does only just thank heavens this is my cleansing balm it's my lemon scented cleansing balm and i love the smell of this first of all I really like the, like the lemony fresh smell and I'm so glad that I picked that as a scent. And that's what it looks like on the inside and you just take a little bit, pop it onto your skin and just rub it in, melts away your makeup. I did show me using this in a recent vlog that I filmed, but yeah, I really like how quick and simple it is. It doesn't aggravate my eyes or anything like that. I'm super happy with this and I think it is probably my favorite product that I brought out and one that I'm most happiest with. I have slightly, I've not changed the ingredients since I brought it out, but I've changed the amounts of each ingredient to, to kind of perfect it as I've gone along. And I think I've like reached perfection for me with this product right now. So there's this, and also there is a slight dent in the tin because I accidentally dropped it and stood on it, which was not good. I was really annoyed because this was actually a customer's one. So <laughs> I had to make them another one and I had to just think I'm going to have to use this one because there's no way I'm going to sell it when it's got a dent in it. Um, so yeah, but stupid me did that, but I'm not complaining because I wanted to use the new packaging anyway, because at that time I was using the old packaging. My brain is all over, I'm sorry. Product number four is the Vitamin C Serum from Skin Diva. It says it's 20% Vitamin C and E and Ferulic Acid Serum. So this was sent to me from Skin Diva like months and months ago. They also sent me a Hyaluronic Acid Serum, which I've recently run out of. And I did a whole video with them and I was so excited to get these because I am a massive lover of Vitamin C in skincare. If you no, one of my most popular videos on my channel is a vitamin C review of the body shop. And yeah, I, I was just so happy in that video because I'm just obsessed. But I was so excited to receive this and it has 100% lived up and exceeded my expectations. It's so nice. Like as soon as I put this product on, it's just so glowy on my skin. And that is what I love about vitamin C is how glowy it makes your skin. And I don't even know if it does anything in terms of like long-term effects, but short-term effects, like my skin is glowing and I like it. Like that is what I'm here for when it comes to my skincare. And I just like how it feels on my skin. It just glides on really nicely and sinks in really nicely and just leaves a nice glow. I use this at night times, not in the daytime, but if you like kind of glowy skin, this would be perfect or just in best in any kind of vitamin c product so yeah i'm kind of sad because it's kind of running out but i will be purchasing a different vitamin c serum in the future i probably won't repurchase this one but i will try others and then finally for my current favorites number five is this now this is a super cheap product if you want budget products this is definitely the video for you but this is like 75p and it's from shop miss a i did a whole video of shop miss a products um a haul of them and first impressions of them honestly like i get so excited to use this i'm kind of getting sad because it's kind of like running a little bit well it's not running low it's probably halfway down but it's the hydrating facial mask with hyaluronic acid hyaluronic acid is super hydrating for the skin so i knew i would like this product it's like a clay but a hydrating clay mask and i've never tried anything that's like a hydrating clay mask usually they're quite stripping and kind of like skin clearing and like you know removing of like impurities whereas this one's hydrating and yeah it goes onto your face like 
um, obviously the white colour sets down, you wash it off and it just makes your skin feel so soft and genuinely I get super excited to use this because I alternate between my masks every day and when it's the day to use this I'm so excited because I know how soft my skin's going to feel and just even applying the product I like, I don't know what it is, I just really love this. It's a really nice product for the price and I would really highly recommend that this is my current skincare favorites at the minute is there a bit of hair like poking out i'm very sorry if that's been like that this whole video um but yeah that's my current favorites i'm super happy with everything i will do an update of this video in a few months time when my kind of day-to-day -day skincare products that i use have like switched around but yeah i might make this video for makeup so let me know if you want to see that but thanks for watching and give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe please. I will see you next week on Wednesday and Friday at 9am. Bye!